Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com with our last break of the night, a 12-box H-O-R-S-E horse basketball mixer where we're giving away a Break King box. $600 plus value right there. You can see it right in the middle of your screen. There it is. Now remember, this box is not a part of the break. We're giving it away. We're shipping it sealed. You can do whatever you want with it. You can open it, see what's inside, or you can, uh, or you can uh, sell it if you want to. Big thanks to all of these folks. I think Paul Nixon, yeah, you got the last spot mojo right here. These folks bought their spots straight up, and these are the winners. There's the first cello pack break, and there's the cello pack break we just did a moment ago. So congrats to the winners, and thank you to everybody who got their teams straight up as well. Let's roll. Let's randomize it nine times, six and a three. And ninth and final time, we got Lewis all the way down to Tyler. Seven, eight, and ninth and final time. After nine times, we got the Suns down to the Nuggets. All right, so Lewis with the Suns, Kevin with the Bulls, Maverick with the T-Wolves, Pano with the Jazz, Chris with the Knicks, Paul, last spot, Mojo, Heat, Trailblazers for Troy, Steven with the Spurs, Sean with the Rockets, Greg with the Pacers, Rob with the Raptors, Chris with the Celtics, Johnny with the Cavs, Wes with the Sixers, Jesse with the Clip Show, Derek with the Pels, Bradley with the Thunder, Anthony with the Magic, Jason with the Nets, Chris with the Kings and the Grizzlies, uh, one spot he bought, one spot he won. Josh with the Warriors, Bradley with the Pistons, Keith with the Hornets, Renee with the Mavs, Diane with the Hawks, Rob with the Bucks, Edwin with the Wizards, Pano, you got my Lakers, and Tyler with the Denver Nuggets. I'm going to alphabetize by team. And I'm going to pause the video. I'm going to set up all the boxes right here, and then we will break and see if there's any trade. Stick around. We'll be right back. And we're back. There was a lot of trade chatter, but at the end, no, no deals were done. So there it is, and here we go. That's the official printout. Good luck, everybody. And this we'll give away to someone at the end. Remember, it's not part of the break. So I'll do the randomizer. It's going to go to All right, what should we do first? Let's just, I'm just gonna grab boxes and we're just gonna, we're just gonna go. These aren't numbered, so I'm just going to breeze by those. Nice Brandon Ingram rookie into to Junta Murray. Relic, Spurs. That's going to go to Stephen Bayless. And the Brandon Ingram rookie will go to Pano and the Lakers. There's Jakob Pertle as well. Elite, 13-14. Giannis here? Oh, we got some NHRA on the TV here too. FS1, if you guys are into that sort of thing. I don't know if like funny car racing would be terrifying 
or if it would be really, really fun. Or maybe it's both. Or any of these, like, funny car... You know, those rocket engine ships. <laughs> rocket engine cars that you have there. We'll sleeve and top load all of those later. Keep hitting that stack there. Richard Lewis, relic for Orlando. That'll be for Anthony V. Jeff Withy, jersey and autograph, rookie jersey and autograph for the Pelicans. What's he doing these days? There's Derek Payne with old Jeff to five ninety nine. There's Udonis Haslam die cut. Gal Meckel to nine ninety nine. The Udonis Haslam is to sixty, by the way. H. Archibald. Sam Sturry is like, come on, Joe. 330 miles per hour would be amazing. I, I'm, I have a feeling I'd enjoy it. It's John, see, I, like, I would have no problem like, like doing like a, a super speedway in NASCAR, right? I feel like that doesn't, I feel like that doesn't scare me. I guess maybe it's because it's more closer, closely associated with what I do in real life when I drive. But I don't know. I just feel like, I feel like, I don't know. I feel like this would be a little, I'm undecided on it. NASCAR, I would, I would love to do that. There's Michael Carter Williams Sixers edition. That'll be for Wes Thomas to 175. I would love to, love to race NASCAR. That'd be a lot of fun. We gotta put less of these in mixers. <laughs> also, maybe I also don't like the fact that it's just like, oh, I guess whoever has the the fastest reaction time to the light, and then you hit the pedal, and you switch gears at the right times. And then it's over in like a second. Perhaps I like the, 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 the strategy. Perhaps I like the strategy of NASCAR better. Like the strategy over like 500 laps. I mean, that's more appealing to me. In just a quarter mile. Miller Booth, I drive a, a 2020 Mini Cooper four-door S-Type. It's, I, I play, it's like playing Mario Kart every day when I drive. It's pretty quick. A nice... Dual clutch, seven speed, twin turbo engine. It's very enjoyable. Mm -hmm. 
Shocked I haven't gotten a speeding ticket yet. Someday. Someday I will. Sometimes I draft behind behind cars. I don't think I could actually get a draft effect. At what speed would you actually get an effect from from drafting behind the uh, car? I feel like you'd have to be consistently over like a hundred miles per hour, maybe more to even take advantage of that. Maybe the aerodynamics of my car does not allow proper drafting to happen anyway. Is that? No, that's just regular Ola Depot. R.I.P. Kobe. DeMar DeRozan. D. Wade. Oh, I was. I thought there was gonna be an autograph in there. D. Wade. Paul Nixon with the Heat. Last spot mojo. And there's Devin Marble to 249. Wait, do we, we like Spencer Dinwiddie. We, we need to set that aside, right? It was rookie Spencer Dinwiddie was back there, wasn't it? Pistons playing some playing some good ball for the for the Nets until the season hit the pause button. Orlando Magic, this autograph will go to Anthony. What do you need, Maverick? T Wolves. Who are we hoping for on T Wolves? I guess maybe. Maybe you're thinking Carl Anthony Towns. I forget what year he was. Looking for that guy. Press proof, Jordan Hill. Chris Paul to 999. Oh, I just need to be close to a big enough truck and get in the airway. But would that give me enough drafting power to slingshot around the truck like they do in NASCAR? I can definitely feel that. Like when if I'm driving fast enough and I'm, I get near a truck, you know, my car will kind of, I'll, I'll feel the, the air. But I guess I don't have the, I don't have the technique to uh, slingshot around it using the, using that draft. Again, I'm not sure if I'm, I'm. I'm I feel like I need enough velocity to to get there. The John Starks die cut autograph, nice. Chris Erickson, Knicks, five out of forty nine on that one. Things like successful business guy now. I think John Starks. Rookies, Joel Embiid rookie, nice. Press proof, Lance Stevenson, Kevin Love, the answer. Look at that, Sixers. That'll be for Wes Thomas and the 76ers. Nice, Joel Embiid. Is it, are you numbered? It's not, but some, some kind of wacky, wavy... Inflatable tube man parallel. All right, next box. What year is Oh, this is current year, 1920. Donner's Optic Hoops. We did blasters of these earlier tonight. Now here's a hobby box.
of people get into to race cards. I feel like I feel like you're a lot of times you're just born into it. I feel like like Austin Dillon, I think his grandfather or something like that is is like racing family. I feel like there's a lot of you're just kind of born into this racing. But I don't know how you get into it nowadays. Like if you want to become a NASCAR driver, if you're like a a kid in the suburbs and the burbs and you're just like, hey, I want to be a NASCAR driver. I know, what was it, William Byron, I think, someone was telling me that he started with iRacing and then was, I think, like the story goes, like his dad was like, didn't want to sit in, sitting in front of a computer and said, let's go out and do the real thing. Maybe you start with like go-kart racing? I guess there's kart racing and then you become good at that and <laughs> I really don't know. A lot of, I mean, yeah, I'm sure a lot of money would help. There's Tremont Waters 99. <laughs> it's almost every day. I don't know, sometimes I'm just too, too lazy to do my hair. Or, I mean, sometimes the hair and makeup girl isn't here every day. A lot of money. Oh, yeah, I probably do need a lot, a lot of money to... Ooh, Kobe White autograph. Nice. Kind of snuck up on me. They're usually flipped around. Uh, Bulls. Kevin with the Bulls. There you go. 82 out of 99. He's pretty solid. P.J. Washington, rated rookie hollow for the Hornets. Keith with Charlotte. He's pretty solid, too, P.J. Washington. And the rookie, Zion Williamson. There's Darius Baisley, orange. That'll be for the Pelicans. Derek Payne got randomized the Pels in this one. All right, 18-19 hoops. Trey Young, Luka Doncic. You can't compute what my hair looks like. You do know, Sean, that we record videos. We record videos, and they are archived all on this channel. You can probably go back. I think maybe Saturday, Friday or Saturday. Did the old, did the old mop top? Did the old, did the old do? Got it. So Sam's saying go-karts, mini sprints, sprint cars, legend cars. The thing is, like, you would think that maybe Southern California doesn't seem like a, a hotbed of racing. It, it is, though. The Where they're doing these, these quarter-mile funny car races is, like, maybe 20 minutes from where I grew up. You know, when I go home and visit my parents, I drive by that all the time. It's like the big Pomona Speedway. And then obviously the, the big NASCAR track, the California Speedway, or Auto Club Speed, whatever it's called now, the California Speedway is in Riverside? Is it Riverside? Montana. Fontana. Right, right, right. I live, I literally walk to it. It's like a five-minute walk. Is that right? See, why aren't we not race car drivers, Vanessa? Like, it's, it's in our area where we grew up, and it was just fun, kind of funny. Like, like, I don't know, like, how people get into it, but a lot of people do. So the so access is, is is here in the area. Obviously Southern California, big car culture. So access is there, but I don't know. I guess dirt tracks is something we don't have. Unless you grew up in the desert, like in the Palm Springs area. A lot of kids out a lot of racing out there. The kids out there. In the in the dunes. I don't know. Things could have been different for old for old Joe Jaspi, ladies and gentlemen, if if he got into racing. There's hot signature rookies, Robert Williams. I would enjoy a nice road course.
You know, I can do I can do an oval. I can be an aggressive driver. That goes to Chris. Joel and B, that's some sort of parallel. You know, maybe I could have been could have been a rally car driver in Europe. Driving a uh, driving a Peugeot. Right? They still make rally cars, right? In France. I could have been driving up racing up Pikes Peak. In Colorado. Another Celtics autograph? There you go. It's Chris D. My Instagram, at Jaspies Breaks. To race up Pikes Peak. It'd be pretty fun. Maybe I'll just have to. Maybe I'll just have to. Uh, all right, that's the Jaron Jackson Jr. rookie year. I've, we haven't seen any Doncic's, right? I haven't missed any. Some. I feel like someone would have yelled at me if they're like, "Hey, you passed it." I guess I could just convert the old Mini Cooper into a race car, into a rally car. Alright, that's it for that one. The John Cooper Works edition of the of the miniature Cooper it was really expensive. I was like, no, I don't want that. I kind of did, but then I was just like, not for that price. It's like over, like, it's like a $35,000 car. It's like, I'm not paying that for a miniature Cooper. No thanks. All right, next box. We're getting there. So this is the Jason Tatum years. So that's what we're looking for. That's what Chris is looking for, Boston Celtics. Among some others, but. What's next? No, nothing, Joe P. This is already going to take us well past quitting time for us. Email us, Joe P. Yeah, we'll, we'll make sure that all the breaks that we do are perfect for your for your specific needs. Email them, seriously. Jaspiescasebreaks at gmail.com, Joe P. And then make that suggestion. Couldn't hurt. Oh, Jason, not, not a hollow. Yeah, shoot him an email. Maybe it could use a little reconfiguring. Frank Jackson, rated rookie, hollow, autograph, Pelicans. That'll go to Derek Payne. You never know. He, he might listen to you, Joe P. He'll be like, you know what? It's a good idea, Joe P. There's Tyler Dorsey. It's 99. 
All right, see ya. Night. Jason Jasper will be here early tomorrow, folks. He'll be uh, here at 11 a.m. Pacific, and he'll be rocking that uh, that tribute stuff and whatever else sells out. Think people will pay? Do, would people pay for a random number block? Think they will? What? How much is it now? This is kind of how much? How much are these? These are kind of expensive. I mean, it's already sixty-two ninety-nine a spot, and that's divided up into. One spot gets you three random players on a big list right here. Yeah, they are pretty pricey. Kyle Kuzma, hollow. No, sorry, Wes. Veteran commons don't ship in, in this. There's Harry Giles as stated in the product description. Oh, oh, that's a five box, right? I see, I see. Well, email him. Is there a full, is there a full, did Leaf give us a full checklist for random letters? I'm more inclined to do numbers. If we had to change it. What do I wanna do, what do I like? Let's just, let's knock the hoops out of the way. Numbers would honestly be easier. It requires less less work. You know what I mean? <laughs> like, because we'll do letters and then someone will be like, yeah, but there's only that many. You should have comboed these letters and comboed that letter. Maybe I'll just blame Joe P. I'll just be like, tell Joe P. He made the he made up the letter. He made up the letter combos. Yell at him. Number block break actually not that bad. One box, one, one or two box number blocks. What's the highest number in that set? Like, is there like a... Like there's nothing to 99, right? I think it's all like lowish numbers, like 25 and under, perhaps. What year is this? This is 2012-13, all right, so. Anyone ever do this? Be honest. Anyone ever do baller beats? Dribble to the beat of hot tracks, build ball handling skills, and unlock Panini NBA trading cards. You can tell me. I'd like to know. Don't be shy. Don't be embarrassed. Especially if you were like the number one baller beats player of the year. Like, like I want to know like if you really got into it. Like you, you, you did it thinking that it would just be something goofy that you would try, but then it ended up like consuming your life and you got really good at it. You were just naturally inclined. No, oh, nothing here, huh? Just, this is just a blaster box, but. Uh, totally certified, sure. <laughs> yeah, is that right, Maverick? You used baller beats and it turned you into a dribble god. Basketball dribbling, or are you dribbling out of the corner of your mouth? Because <laughs> your brain got numbed by, by baller beats. Is that someone, someone go to this website. Does it still exist? NBABallerBeats.com. 
like they like someone put work I mean someone put work into this this is a this is an Xbox title right here Xbox Connect title was this at you know what that's I'll bet it was supposed to be like it's supposed to be like like a dance dance revolution but for but for dribbling a basketball perhaps that, that's what I that's what I see in my head Darren Con these purple ones are not numbered by the way there is Jim Shones Jim Shons remember uh remember Sean Figgins which it's a Eleven nine. Sean Figgins would spell his name like that. I'm going Jim Sean's. Gons? Is that a G or a C? It's, that's poor, poor typography there. Fire the person who made that font. There's OG on OB. It's not the Porzingis here, right? No. This is the Tatumir. Fabric of the the website does not exist anymore, says Theoden. 144 to 199. Fabric of the game, Dallas Mavericks, Renee. Nicola Batum to 99. Tyler Dorsey to 299. Status. Maverick says they don't need the website. He's got the world title. He's the champ. The champ is here. Champ's here. If you don't know, now you know, says Maverick Booth. The NBA Baller Beats champ. No, there, there's 45 people watching this late at night. No one's admitting to buying this for their Xbox. NBA Baller Beats. Nobody bought that. I mean, even if you're a kid, did you ask, or when maybe you were a kid at the time, made your parents pony up the $60 to buy NBA Baller Beats and you played it once. Not exactly the, uh, not exactly a, like a Call of Duty type franchise was launched. That it is not. TJ Leaf, Pacers, Greg. Watch, there's going to be like this crew of people that like are really all about NBA, that NBA baller beats life. And then they, uh, and then they're just going to stream into my chat tomorrow and be like, you don't know what you're talking about, man. NBA baller beats is life. You don't understand. You're just dumb. You just open up baseball cards. What do you know? I'll be like, yeah, you're right. What do I know? Pistons. You don't know. It's life, man. You don't know. Really? There's going to be an army of people protesting outside outside Jaspie's properly social distance, but protesting and be like, you got to apologize to the NBA Baller Beats community, man. Better apologize to us. We demand an apology from Joe Jaspi. It's probably better than, than 2K, Arthur says. Yeah, hold on. I never got a real clear, expo clear explanation on that Ronnie 2K guy. Ronnie? Robbie? Ronnie 2K guy? Like, people really dislike him. So, 
I don't know which way this goes. Are the autographs on the bottom? Are these on the it goes this way? I think it goes this way. I might have to give this a try. Right, right, right. I'm knocking it. I've never even played it. I, maybe I should buy an Xbox and then buy that. And then two weeks later, as I'm spinning a basketball in my hand and rolling it around my neck into like a little hoop like that, doing basketball tricks, and it's spinning on, on my finger, I'll be like, you guys, it's actually a really great game. <laughs> my, my ball handling skills are so much better now. Out of 269 Ben McElmore, I am, I am killing it on the courts. I mean, not now. We're socially distant, so we don't play pickup basketball anymore. But when we do, you know, in New York, in the city, they, they, the, the city started taking down hoops. Not, they're not even closing. They were just like straight up taking down hoops in a lot of areas. I was like, oh, man, that's rough. Like, so even if you're just by yourself and trying to shoot a couple hoops to get outdoors, just have to imagine it. All right, Jakob Pertle, jersey and autograph to 199 Raptors. That'll be for Rob. Really? Theoden's on the wiki for, for baller beats, and it actually got sevens for ratings. Is that good? Or it was seven out of ten? That's not horrible. Kelly Olenek, jersey and autograph, Boston Celtics to 149. That'll be for Chris. And Shaq, Shaq Daddy, Shaquille O'Neal, Big Aristotle, Big Diesel, 12 out of 15. I missed that Shaq show today. Why didn't anyone remind me about the Shaq show? They're probably repeating it, right? Game War material for the Cavs. That'll be for Johnny Cannon. Forgot about that Shaq show. All right, Court Kings, and then we'll close with Prism and see if we can pull a, a Silver Zion or a Silver Jaw to close out the night. Oh, this doesn't have the thumb notches. Come on, Panini. I think the next year they did have thumb notches. Oh, yeah, there's this too. Could some of those be autographed? I feel like I remember vague memories of some of those being, being, being autographed, the box toppers. All right, this motorcycle one I definitely would not do. Like that's terrible. Where where they have where they fly on the little. They've got those stabilizers, but the motorcycle thing. Forget about that. That's no thanks. Now, some of these have different levels on them, but. There's Bryce Johnson. It's rookie level one. Deonta Davis, rookie level two. I think four is the most short printed. Robert Covington to 175. Andre Drummond, Maestro's insert. Should be Jimmy Butler in an auto. There's Jimmy Butler, relic, performance art relic for the Bulls to 249. That's for Kevin. The autograph is a Dallas Maverick. It is Fresh Paint Autograph, A.J. Hammonds. Mmm, ham. That'll be for Renee. All right. Auto? Use this. All right. Oh, come on. I see old Raptors logo. I see Vince Carter's name. No auto. But nice Vince Sanity. Rookie royalty. Kyle Young, he looks there. Nice. So that goes to Rob and the Raptors. That right there.
All right, we made it. Last box. Let's keep those vocal cords high. There's an RJ Barrett already. Oh, you know what? I forgot about this. We got to give this away. I almost forgot about the giveaway. There you go. So if you're like, ah, oh, Joe, what a what a crappy mixer. I didn't get anything. It happens, unfortunately. Well, you still have a shot at that box right there, which has three cards per box. I think there's usually one or two graded cards in there. They're not all autos, but I I, I think I think there's just like be like an RJ Barrett like Gem Min 10 or something like that, but like silver. Stuff like that. I think we've done some breaks of these, so if you want an example, you can you can look up the videos on our channel. Um, it's worth a look. I think it's really good. It's a nice repack product. They did a good job. So apparently, this box what retails at at least six hundred dollars. So if you're like Joe, bad break for me, man. This sad times. Um, well, you still have a shot at that. One spot in thirty is going to get that. Which is good. It's good odds for a $600 box. We're, we're going to send it to you sealed. Now you can you can rip it if you want to, and if you do, shoot us an email, jaspiescasebreaks at gmail.com, and let us know what you got. I'd be curious. Or or come and be better yet, come into the chat when I'm on air and be like, hey, thanks for the box. I I got a X Y Z. Speaking of shipping, now that we're here at the end, remember. Stuff has been been significantly delayed by the postal service. If you get a tracking confirmation from us, oh, there go the hits. If you see a tracking confirmation from us, there you go. TJ Leaf is safe, ladies and gentlemen. Don't worry, TJ Leaf is fine. If you get a tracking number from us, an order confirmation email, that means it's shipped, usually that day. So it's already out the door, but Post Service just has not been scanning anything just because they've just been so slammed. There you go. There's RJ Barrett for the Knicks. That's for Chris Erickson. So they just haven't been able to scan things. And on top of that, stuff just, shipments just have been delayed by one to. Sometimes, in some cases, seven business days, somewhere in between there. There's no rhyme or reason. It's just... So be patient with us. Be patient with the Postal Service, ladies and gentlemen. We appreciate it. It's just the times that we live in. Hopefully, we can all do our part and get back to some kind of normalcy sooner rather than later. That Andre Roberson red wave not numbered, by the way, but it will ship. So do your part, ladies and gentlemen. I want live sports back. So do you. So encourage your friends and family to do the right thing. Nice John Morant base, Chris Erickson with the Grizzlies. Chris Erickson, you got the you got randomized the you won those spots. And you randomized the got randomized the Grizzlies and the Knicks. It's not a bad randomizer. And a shot at that. Tyler Hero, Instant Impact Silver. Chumo Kiki, Rookie Silver. A lot of great value in those Rookie Silvers. And Keldon Johnson, that's for the Spurs. Stephen B, the San Antonio rookie penmanship. Cameron Johnson. And we're going to close with... Now, Nikola Vucevic, Pink Pulsar to 42. Zion, Jaw, Silver. Who are you? No, you're Ursan Ilyasova. You're KG. 
No, I was hoping for like a big silver Zion that'll go for a million dollars. But unfortunately, not. But I think it was a pretty solid break. Thanks for watching, everybody. Appreciate it. Hopefully, if you end up getting NBA Baller Beats for your Xbox, let me know how that plays. Appreciate it. Let's flip back to the list right here. Everyone has a shot at the box. So blank list, new dice roll, everybody involved, name on top after eight times, five and a three, we'll get it. One, good luck everybody. Two, and thank you for getting in. Three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. All right, all of you here, not winners, but I appreciate you getting in. Thank you for your support. All right, five, four, three, two. Congrats to Diane. Some girls have all the luck. Diane S. with the box. Diane, this will be shipped to you, sealed. If you choose to rip it open, let us know what you get. Or you can sell it if you want to. Whatever. It's yours. So do whatever you want with it. Joe for Jaspies. Congrats again. Joe for Jaspies. Casebreaks.com. I'll see everybody uh, tomorrow. Remember, Jason Jaspie going live early, 11 a.m. Pacific, 2 p.m. Eastern. And then I'll be following a few hours after that. And, uh, and we'll do more of this craziness all over again. Thanks, everyone. Joe for Jaspies. Casebreaks.com. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.